Hello and welcome. This is today in the news. First, the highlights. Inogun State Police Command foils alleged kidnap attempt on road users. Police operatives in Kaduna State rescue three individuals kidnapped by bandits in Zaria. Presidential election petitioned court to deliver a judgment on 6th September. Enugu State Police Command has fought an alleged kidnap attempt on some road users at Ogbeke Nike along Ugo Nike Open Suka Road. This was made public in a statement signed by the Command Public Relations Officer, DSP Daniel Undukwe. He said two of the miscreants were neutralized on the spot while others escaped with gunshot wounds. DSP Undukwe disclosed that the hoodlums reportedly blocked the road and shot sporadically before the operatives of EIP's escort on duty gallantly responded. The statement reads that Commissioner of Police CP Kanayo Zuebu laments the passing of one of his personnel who paid the supreme prize. Police operatives in Kaduna State have rescued three individuals who had been kidnapped by bandits in the Zaria local government area of the state. In an official statement, ASP Manian Hassan, acting spokesman of the Kaduna Police Command, reported that the victims were rescued during a proactive patrol in the Kuraga Wusasa area of Zaria. Hassan further disclosed that the rescue operation was conducted in collaboration with local vigilante groups who, based on credible information, ventured into the forest. The people of Shakiri ethnic nationality in Delta State have threatened to shut down all oil flow stations operating in their various communities if the multinational companies fail to implement Petroleum Industrial Act through Iwere Host Community Development Trust. They disclosed this after a meeting of chiefs in Wari Kingdom, along with sons and daughters of the Wari Nation. Defying the rain, natives of Ishakiri gathered at Atuashe, the second model primary school field, Wari South local government area, to meet with the Lubashiri of Wari Kingdom and other chiefs. Their focus is the Petroleum Industry Act implementation, and after hours of deliberation, they reached the resolution. They also resolved to support the decisions of the Olu of Wari, Ogiami Atuashe III, towards ensuring a smooth execution of PIA as they call on those in opposition to align. The Presidential Election Petition Court will on 6th September deliver judgment on the petitions filed by the People's Democratic Party, Labour Party and the Allied People's Party challenging the outcome of the 2023 presidential election. Registrar of the Court of Appeal, Umar Bangari, in a telephone conversation confirmed the date to TVC News.